we're going to work on today is the micro braids 100% human hair. Now, micro braids could be done with any type of hair, some people do synthetic hair, but we are going to be working on the 100% human hair. There's a huge difference between when you work with the human hair and when you work with the synthetic hair. And what we're going to do is make this strands of hair very very small that's what hundred that's what micro braids is all about and some people call it medium braids but you know what world braiding represents we represent glamour natural hair glamour so this hairstyle can also be used for protecting your hair especially during um, winter when the weather is going really dry there's no moisture in the atmosphere and so what actually happens is your hair starts breaking so this is the best time to wear lots of protective hairstyles a micro braids is one of those hairstyles we recommend. So I'm going to show you the materials we need for that. But to get us started, here is our young, glamorous model, Aniela. So you know what world of braiding represents? We represent education, information, and skills. So we're going to tell you all you need to get this technique started. Okay, so the one we are working with today, it says 100% European human hair and it's chenilles. That's what we'll be working with. But this other one I'm holding is one of my favorites. It's called Sensational Premium Plus and it's bulk. So remember that word bulk. Whenever you're doing human hair braids, that's what you need, bulk. Let it not be weaving bulk because when it's bulk, the strands are prepared for braiding. The weaving one, the strands are actually meant for creating weaves. So, so when you get your hair out of the bag, this is what you'll be getting. And this sharp cut is what we call the bulk. So some of them come two little bags in a pack, while some come in different forms. Some are actually four. So it would depend on what particular brand you bought and what it contains. And you see how that feels very silky now benefits of 100% human hair you'll be asking me why would anyone want to wear 100% human hair they are very very light and this is one of them. okay so together started they come like that and this is what we mean by bulk so you have this little string tied around it so you take that out now some brands you actually see there's even another string that hold them together but some come exactly like that and this is where it is important you are very very careful with your 100% human hair because one of the really bad thing about it is it's very fragile so if you start being rough with them if you start handling them the same way you handle your synthetic hair all of this hair is going to be on the floor and they come very expensive so if you lose all of this your client is not going to be happy with you because she's invested a lot of money into it so this is one of the important reasons you have to learn from this DVD how to handle this hair so you don't waste okay so to get started remember to hold the hair very close to the tip and these hairs are slippery, so they have a tendency to drop down if you don't hold them firmly. So you push it to your picking fingers and you take just a little bit. Aha. Getting your braiding started with, my, with human hair. So you take that. So if you already know how to braid, remember our introduction to hair braiding DVD, you will already know what to do with this part. But the most important thing in the micro braids or human hair braiding is making sure you know how to turn that blunt end, insert it in, and braid. So I'm going to be showing you a few more times how you work with that. Okay, so when you finish your braids, what you're going to be seeing in between are just little bits of hairs hanging out. See that? Now this you can trim off because that's not your client's hair. And that makes that very smooth. So take your time. Go through them. Take out those bits. Okay, so this hair product is called Virgin Hair Fertilizer. This is one of my favorite products. 
for growing hair back now especially when your client has relaxed hair chemically processed hair and then there's new growth coming up see the new growth right here to be able to pick that what i do is put that product in my hand and i just mesh it into her hair what it does it actually helps me to have good grip over it because if this was natural virgin hair what i've been doing is putting regular products like moisturizers to make it soft but this is already very soft so i don't need to soften here anymore i'm trying to soften the one coming up so that's why i've just put some bit of that product down there it helps me to be able to pick the hair out easily i remember it helps to grow hair as well we have that in store so if you do need it you know where to go it's one of my favorite products and i recommend it to people who have hair damage so now so this is our last strand you can see we've been busy at work all day applying products and this is a mousse from barry barry so the next One. thing is the mousse sorry the polisher or serum so again use very little not too much there you have it your micro braids 100 percent human hair Okay, so like we said earlier, water braiding is the place to come to when you want knowledge, information and skill. And you remember when we started, we said this hairstyle is the type that you need between three to four people to get it quickly done. Now, you may work with your colleagues to help you sometimes, but I was lucky I have a very young assistant. Come on here, my girl. She's only 10, that's young mega. I'm sure you've seen her in a few of our videos. That's my little girl. She helps me a lot. She loves braiding. And I had to use her skill today. So she helped to make this work a lot easier. It took about, I think between six to seven hours. Now, normally micro braids sometimes takes about 12 hours. So we did well, didn't we? Yes. yes. So there you have it, your 100% human hair, micro braids. And we look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thank you.